Welcome to this week's edition of Shap Chat is uh, the LCU men's basketball program with a big set of games this week. They're, they're back home in Center Athletic Conference play hosting John Brown University and also hosting Rogers State University. Coach, we don't know the rankings right now of each one of those squads, but they're very good ranked squads, especially John Brown University that uh, has yet to suffer a loss in conference play. Well, both teams have a tradition of success, and uh, we've had some success against them, but uh, they are they present a challenge not just for us, but for everybody in the league. And so to have them at home, we're at a position where we really need to um, get a couple of wins and you know get ourselves back up into the conference standing. So hopefully if we do that, we'll have a chance. Well, I know you're coming off two losses. What is there a big adjustment change? I mean, you're coming off two losses. Not to say it's hard to be optimistic hosting two teams at home, but this team seems to play uh, play up to the standards you want them to when they're here at home. Well, it's a fine line because obviously what you were trying to do wasn't successful, but yet, you know, we see just a few things that if we improve on, we believe that you know we we're right there. So it's it's not too many big adjustments. It's just fine tuning the little things, pointing those things out to the guys, and and of course you gotta you gotta come ready to play. We've had good weeks of preparation and. We feel confident at home, but a lot of that, you know, we have to show up and do it too. So we're excited about the challenge and uh, just putting in the hard work, getting ready to do it. Coach, best of luck. Okay, thanks, Chris. Coach Todd Duncan joining us. Right now, let's take a look at uh, the Lady Shaps and some of their highlights as both these teams were at USAO in Chickasha, Oklahoma. Only one game was played last week. Here are those results. Left side, Wilson into the paint, puts it around one side, it's good. Courtney Wilson with the bucket, the first, here in the top, in the Canavan, trying to back her way in. Canavan going up to the right hand side, it's off the glass, and good. Canavan with her first point to the second half. Pass down low, and the layup here is good, underneath by Haley Fowler. On that, the pass, near side, Hopper, Hopper, the left baseline, feeds it on. This is the Hampton. Transfer the point to Canavan, right side, Fowler. 13.45 to go. Fire on the drive. The shot off the glass is good on the penetration by Fowler. To Wilson. Wilson. Back to the right side. The three on the way, and that is good. The three hit by Blair Taylor. The women's basketball team retook their number one position as they defeated USAO 86-54. to The Lady Shaps will be playing John Brown University this Thursday at 6 p.m. at the Rip Griffin Center followed by Roger State University this Saturday at 1 p.m. The men's basketball team also played against USAO, but fell 82-72. to The LCU men's team will be playing along with the Lady Shaps this Thursday and Saturday at the Rip Griffin Center. Thanks for tuning in for our first Shap Chat of the new year, and tune in for more LCU sports action.